At Jason Lee Middle School, creativity is found at more than 2,000 degrees. Put your jack line in a little bit better, and then you're going to wad it off. Aiden Rosa. They're called blow pipes. An eighth grader. And you get to blow through them. Is one of 650 kids across Tacoma. Blow. Who are part of Hilltop Artists. A glass blowing program for young people in the city. Stop. I found out in elementary and I was like, oh my gosh, I want to do this when I'm in middle school. Miles Johnson has made almost anything you can think of. Today it's a bird, the other day. I made a carton of milk over here because I uh, really like drinking milk, so I fill up a whole glass carton of milk and drink it. Behind the fun are lessons. It's just really fun figuring out how you're going to make this because you're like, oh, I'm going to make a carton of milk. How am I going to do this? And then you think through it, figure it out. You blew it out a little bit too far. Glass blowing is one of those things that you can't do by yourself. And so our students here are learning verbal communication, nonverbal communication, all kinds of team building skills while they're learning how to make glass. And so those soft skills are what's really important. Kimberly Keith is the executive director of Hilltop Artists. And I went to Jason Lee. This was my middle school. And so I'm very much one of those Hilltop kids. I'm a mixed race person that was raised by a single parent three blocks from here. And so I am very much the young people that I work with in this program. She says at Jason Lee, 9% of the students are homeless and some of the kids in the program face additional challenges. They've experienced trauma, they've experienced neglect, they've experienced lots of negative things. So we need a positive place for them to come to, to work with adults who genuinely care about their thoughts and their opinions. I like that you can be very creative with it. And you can, um, you can basically make whatever you want, just, you just need the skills to make it. But it's passion too, that helps them turn glass into art. In Tacoma, Jenna Hanchard, King 5 News.